The Supreme Court justices heard arguments on whether ghost guns can be regulated like regular firearms. Ghost guns are usually sold in parts online, which can be self-assembled with no serial numbers, making them hard for police to trace. But nothing in Congress's use of the term weapon suggests that it has to presently be functional as an instrument of combat in order to qualify. According to the ATF, the number of ghost guns recovered by police jumped more than 1,000 percent from 2017 to 2021. The case in front of the Supreme Court centers around an executive order by President Biden, which requires companies to add serial numbers to ghost guns and run background checks on buyers. Gun rights groups protested. They argue those requirements exceed the ATF's authority because under law, weapon kits don't meet the definition of a firearm. During arguments yesterday, Justice Alito invoked omelets as a potential comparison. I put out on a counter some eggs, some chopped up ham, some chopped up pepper and onions. Uh, is that a Western omelet? No, because those items have well-known other uses to become something other than an omelet. The key difference here is that these weapon parts kits are designed and intended to be used as instruments of combat, and they have no other conceivable use. Rhiannon Alley, ABC News, New York.